All right, we're here with the guys from Evergrey here in Pittsburgh at Mr. Smalls in the illustrious courtyard. Yeah. yeah. Huh? How is everybody today? Good? Yes, yeah, good. Good? Yeah, great. Excellent. Uh, everybody sounded great in sound check, so cool. sounds like uh, we'll sound good today. Uh, what's your favorite thing about coming to America? Um, it's <laughs> very different from uh, Europe. Like, the yeah, vibe. The vibe is different. Uh, but and, and everything is kind of the same. You can always get a whole of a, you know, hamburger at 3 8 o'clock in the morning, whenever, <laughs> you know, seven days a week, uh, which you can't in, in many most places. Uh, most places, yeah. yeah. So that it's m way more convenient yeah. in that way. So uh, that's nice. Are, are the metal fans much different? Uh, in in different countries since you guys get to travel the, you know the world yeah, but, but at the same time i think fans are very different in different states here as well because oh. i, I mean mm -hmm. this, this is such a huge country so, so, so it's uh, i mean they yeah everybody's different but, yeah. but kind of the same in the end as well i mean everybody's music fans yeah right so well, the only thing that we can judge it is how much they share by the end of the show i think and uh, they've been sharing a lot of this. Yeah, this uh, leg. Yeah, the fans have uh, they've been amazing well, on every show. So, uh, um, do you find um, maybe a little bit more excitement on this tour because I mean Evergrave was almost no more. Yeah. And you know, it, it, there has to be a little bit of a groundswell to say, hey man, we <laughs> we missed you guys. Yeah, yeah, it's fantastic. But but the most fantastic thing is that we, the five of us, were able to do this together and feel really fine and happy about it. All the five of us, because I, for the first time, I really think that this this really really feels like a band. Whereas yeah. everybody, I, I really want to know what you one thinks about certain things, and you know. What, so I think it's it's a big difference. Everybody really, it's strong now. Yeah, yeah. yeah I, I gotta say as well, this tour, this tour uh, for me, uh, it's been like the easiest. Uh, there, there, there aren't any problems. There's no asshole on the tour, huh? you know, like in any of the bands. Yeah. Everybody is working, doing their shit, uh, uh, um, and always with a smile, you know. So, so yeah, this has been fantastic. What do you attribute that change to? What? What do you attribute that change to? What do you think made the difference between, you know, a few years ago and now? What's the because catalyst? Because now we're focusing on what, what we have instead of what we want. Uh, yeah. And, uh, and to really cherish that and still move fo forward, but, but not to like, uh, just like when, when we decided to, 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 to go different ways, we were just tired with every day, you know, and, uh, and they was trying to prove so much that we don't need those guys and we didn't need every day. But in the end, we, we, we all need each other for, for every day. And when we realized that, I just thought it was just, it just made sense. It just mm -hmm. felt right. Yeah, I think everybody in, in the band have uh, matured over these years and they kind of realized that, hey, it's kind of rare situation we, we actually are in and uh, this um, group of people, you know, and uh, so the, the the caring and the respect is uh, like w uh, like a 180 turn now mm -hmm. because we, we kind of took each other for granted yeah. uh, right before we left. The atmosphere was kind of yeah, it's not great, not great, <laughs> yeah, but it's great now. Um, do you think that that all of those different experiences and so forth manifested itself in in your new record? Yeah, yeah, totally. And and how so? Maybe some specifics. I always say that uh, I feel that this uh, this album has a really like uplifting kind of uh, thing, you know. Even though it's very dark and sad, mm -hmm. but but it's not like it, you just have a, a really hopeful thing in it as well, like. Come on, you know, yeah. mm -hmm. and, and I think that attracts a lot of people uh, because we we had many long meetings. Uh, every one of us in different things and called each other because uh, because I was very concerned if we're going to do this, if oh no, if I'm going to be with and do this, I, I I really need to to do it uh, because it, that situation me and Jonas couldn't come back, and then five months later, it's like now you know what, this was fun. 
because mm -hmm. they would just uh, fuck up the whole brand, the whole, I mean, they were, yeah. all the truth, uh, trust thing mm -hmm. based in Edgar would just be demolished. So, so, so but when we decided it, we just went for it, yeah? and it was just so, just felt so, so good. Yeah, and that was also the, the, the recording of the album and mixing of the album was so easy going and everybody everybody really wanted to bring out the best in another. Uh, so so we, we really pushed each other to play as good as we could possibly do. do and but in a positive way. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. Not like, yeah. come on, I know that you can do this better. Come on, mother. No, yeah. Like that, you know. Yeah. It was like, I mean, I was standing so close to you on one of the songs. I was like... Dude, <laughs> yeah, but it was yeah. great. Yeah. I mean, I, you know, you can really feel the yeah. support. It's like, oh, yeah, and I play better. Yeah, yeah. Because just everybody just sent out good vibes all the time, all the time at everybody. And it's like, I think that's the feeling that you hear on the the yeah. album. Yeah. It's really, really fucking weird, actually. But it, it translates yeah. Yeah. to the listener. Yes. It definitely does. I mean, yeah. you know, it, it, I think it's uh, your best effort. To date, thank you. Um, it, it's an amazing record. Um, so all of those things, you know, it, it's like a lot of the message of the record. You know, you yeah. go through those things, and but you come out, yeah. you know, in the end, maybe a, yeah. a lot better. Yeah. yeah. So change it's, it's, is all good. Yeah. Change is all like improvements. You know, it just takes a while to realize it sometimes. You know, but it's just. Um, what do you think is a, the toughest part about? Um, being in this genre of the music business, what's like so frustrating about it, and and maybe were some of the things that maybe pushed you away for a little bit. No, I think it's uh, as as the genre. I think it could be a hard that that you know uh, that you have to really work a bit harder because it is not going to be as reachable for everybody. You know, mm -hmm. it's like only certain kind of stations that play this. It's like very tight. But once again, but on the other hand, instead of looking at other bands or whatever you know it's like yeah but we have this this is our fan base and this is our fan fan base and nobody yeah. can fuck with that but we're gonna give them the best that we can do every night and hopefully half of them will bring another friend the next time you know it just keeps yeah. growing you know instead of like oh it was only this or this we were like yeah but they paid with their time and their money to see and they deserve to get up the whole thing yeah I mean, metal is uh, is unique in that, you know. I mean, you might not be making, you know, Metallica money, yeah. Yeah. but the fans are loyal. But your friends are loyal. I mean, your fans are super loyal, and um, you have longevity. Yeah. You know, yeah. if you if you keep producing, um, and, and in that manner, um, you guys are kind of are you in the typical two year kind of on the road cycle? Start trying now when we when we get home to start writing more songs. And we okay. have yeah. some, uh, not songs, but a lot of really really good ideas and like skeleton for for a couple of songs already. So uh, we're gonna see. Hopefully we're gonna have. Uh, what's the plan? We're gonna try to have a, uh, an album like May next year. Is that it? Yeah. Wow. Some, some, some sometime next year. Okay. I mean, we you need it uh, while it's warm, you know. Yeah. Fucking go. That's awesome news for fans. Yeah. Oh, very but, uh, cool. Hold, hold, you can't hold it to me that it's going to be in May, but, uh, <laughs> but in, that's the, the, in the neighborhood. That's the, you know? Okay, okay. Hopefully. And then, uh, obviously, we expect you to come back here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, 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 yeah. it's been great. Okay, great. Well, thanks for taking time with us today. Thank you, man. Oh, thank really you. appreciate it, and uh, really looking forward to the show tonight. Yeah, so do we. Thank you. Okay, thank you. All right. thank you.